Hi and welcome back to another Best of Times Reborn YouTube video. I'm your host Brad. We're going to the corner of Lily and Anna Street. Let's show the latest. Bit of an update. It is Sunday the 18th of February 2024. Currently 7.54 a.m. So, I'm your host Brad and this is Best of Times Reborn. Look how bare it is compared to what it was. Well, you can see how fully bare it is compared to what we're used to seeing here. You can see through to the old prices plus in the aquarium, all that. Wait for this vehicle to go past. Do its thing. Give me a weird box, as they do. When there's no one working here, we can go up to the fence and try and get some get some footage as best as we can. Showing as much as we can. So we haven't been able to. This is where the house used to be. You can see the gate there still. 27 Lolly Street. And then where the flats used to be. Over here. Wow. Now I'm not going to enter. It's got all the do not enter and all this stuff. People think I probably would, but no, I don't. Just got to show as much as we can. Only so much I can see, because I can't see the camera screen. So bear with me. Just show as much as I can. Anyway, let's continue along. Doing our thing. So if anyone's wondering where this is, this is across from the Crown Hotel. You've got the BP, you've got Heyman's Electrical, McDonald's, all that close by. Next to Vinny's. If anyone's wondering that side of it, there's a load of box for the those units, flats, whatever you want to call them that were there. They are still weird that this is all gone. It's cleaned up more than when I was last here. I haven't shown it for a while because it's just been too wet. Now you can see the old stairs there, part of the stairs. Yeah, you can see a little bit of detail. So I can get a bit more there. Yeah, let's go. Show what we can. Without any trouble, hopefully. Okay. Yeah, you can only show what we can show. Well, we can. You can see there's parts of the wall still here. Of the old loose fruit market. I don't know how well that shows up. And there's lighting. Oh, here we go. Show through here. Because we're not going through the boundary or anything like that. You can see some of the old flooring there. Hmm. the best we can get I think footage wise unless there's more openings like that around the corner but yeah still weird this being basically gone just rubble now well I think it's just gonna be a uh, concrete pad for a fair while and nothing will happen it's usually how things work for a fair while so we'll just go up and down a few times like we normally do the old least fruit market part this pad here. And Curtin Villa was there for a while. In that spot. The last one here was a job agency. It's been closed for a very long time. I think it moved out to the old high school at one stage. There was a sign there. And where these tiles are, it used to be Bedrock Cafe for ridiculous amount of years. You can see the tiles there. we can, don't want any people coming along and going off. And then this is where um, what's my call it was at the at the end. Um, Tropic cartridges and printing which moved out to 180 Street where the healthier Great Greenway used to be or Blockbuster Video if you remember that far back in that same spot, in that corner, near where the big tomato used to be. Next to Poochie's anyway now. Poochie's has moved out there. Here's where Collins was at the end. And Collins catering. Not Collins food group, they used to own KFC. Or might still do. The ones that used to be Collins cordials. And there's where the 
uh, indigenous artwork place was. Wow. Uh, it's all pretty wild here. Pretty full on. So we can show. Well, we can, while it's possible. Of course, we can't get out inside because of the, the gate and the fence and all this stuff. So I think that's why they've left this part here. So people can't get down there, which is fair enough. So that's Art Shop written on there. So we'll go back past and show what we can while it's possible. While some of this rubble's still here, one day we'll come past and it won't be here. None of this will be here. One day we'll come past and hopefully they'll be building something else. So. Wow. Still wild. You know, one day, even these fences may not be here and it'll just be blank. Maybe just the concrete left there, the cement. That cement looks newer. This one here where Tropic Coaches, cartridges and print used to be. It looks newer than the rest. Keep on to say tropical cartridges and printing but it's tropic. There's plenty of update videos and different ones of what this used to look like before they started doing any of this. If you look on the Innisfail playlist on Best of Science Reborn there's also a thanks button now. They give me the thanks button where you can donate up to between zero, oh, between like a dollar, I think it is, and 400, 500 dollars to the channel if you want to say thanks. So you can donate like 20, 20 dollars, two dollars, 50 dollars, 100 dollars, you know, whatever. Between about a dollar, I think it is, and um, yeah, and the 500 dollar limit would really help the channel out. Just thought I'd mention that, seeing that's a, a new feature for me to have that. You can also donate via the PayPal link in the description. It's also, it'll keep being a thing if anyone feels they want to. Or they can use super stickers and things like that within the, um, within like a premiere, a premiere video or if I ever do a live stream. Never had any luck with live streams. People watch them after, after they're live. They don't watch them at the time when they're on, so. And you lose, I lose picture quality with live streams. So I end up not really doing them. I've tried. So, so we'll get all this video done. Then I'll come past once the camera's put away and get some photos and that. So I might go across the road and everything and then put the camera away. Yeah, if you want to help the channel out, feel free. But even just liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing, getting other people to subscribe and watch videos, that helps. If can get me up to a, a thousand views, I can start getting money out of um, ad revenue, likes, all that sort of stuff. It really helps the algorithm to say, oh, people are watching this, people like it. So we'll recommend it to more people. Yeah, that's how it works, how the algorithm works. Okay, so to give you some context of where this is, you got McDonald's here. The McDonald's car park and that. You got BP here. What we'll do is we'll do the back back the front way than what we normally do, because we usually go across to the crown and then around down across to Heyman's and back this way. But we'll do it this way this time. Before the rain comes back, there is a bit of sun up there. We had a fair bit of rain yesterday. Don't know how many millimetres. My weather station's no good anymore. Otherwise, people would have seen me posting on uh, Innisfail, old and new Innisfail photos on Facebook. If you want to join that, feel free. You'll see photo, lots of photos and links to these videos and all that on there. Feel free to come on that. Quite welcome to. Just adhere to the rules and accept the rules because if you don't accept the rules uh, Facebook doesn't allow it. It'll just 
I won't even see the request to join. A lot of the time they'll just, yeah, they'll just say, nope, <laughs> you're not allowed, sort of thing. And it just, yeah. So you gotta go down to the bottom and accept the rules. It's just no swearing, no. Keep it G-rated, no drug and alcohol stuff. It's basically all that sort of thing. A couple of the rules I made for the group myself and then the majority of them are the Facebook ones. The Facebook makes up for them. There's your BP across there, your Crown. The direction I'm going to, Crown Hotel, just to give you an idea of what's here. This is Lily Street that I'm crossing over. So we'll continue to show across the road. Whoops, didn't realise there was someone there. Thought they were further down, that lady. So we'll stop here for a sec. Might even get a, a bit of a time lapse while I'm while I'm here. So you can see across. There's a BP. Straight across to where we were just before. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is the best of times keeping memories alive for us and future generations to see. Feel free to click the PayPal link in the description to donate to the channel or the thanks button. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Keep watching because I'm going to put some photos on the end, and if I do a time lapse, that'll be on the end somewhere. So keep watching to the where I say thanks for watching and all that on screen. And we'll catch you in the next video. Stay safe, stay cool. See you next time.